All right, it's official. Tiana Taylor announced that she will be portraying Dionne Warwick in the highly anticipated biopic. Tiana shared the exciting news on social media and wrote, thank you for trusting me, Coco Gilbert and our production company with telling your iconic story. We are so excited to make you proud. Now, are y'all excited to see Tiana execute this role? T.S., you already celebrate uh, with the uh, celebration uh. dance, so we're going to go to you first. I am so excited to see Tayana Taylor play this role because um, I do think that she is a good actress. She is beautiful. I love all of her features and there would have been no other actress that I could see, you know, playing uh, the beautiful, gorgeous, young Dionne Warwick, you know? I mean, I do a lot of jokes on Dionne Warwick because, you know, she, she, she does give me chain smoking cigarette auntie. But what we are never, ever going to do is take away Dionne Warwick's accolades. We're not going to take away the impact. She was the first, she's the, our first Grammy winner, Black woman Grammy winner. Am I correct? Am I? Al, you know. You be, yeah, let me see. Let's find out, production. She crossed over before, way before, you know, she paved the way for Whitney Houston to come through to do what she did. And a lot of other uh, artists, you know, they were sampling Dion and still sample Dion to this day. She is, I cannot wait to see her biopic. I can't, and I, I can't wait to see Tayana's kill it. She is good. I love her. Al, what are your thoughts? How you feeling? Ah, you know what? I love this. No, she wasn't the first TS. I think was Ella it? Fitzgerald, Ella Fitzgerald oh, was cool. the first to win a Grammy. I think um, production is saying Dion won the Grammy Lifetime Achievement Award in 2019. Oh. But I know Ella Fitzgerald was the first female, Black female artist to win a Grammy. But I love this. I remember, you guys remember a couple of years ago when Dion first tweeted about this, when I didn't even know she knew how to work Twitter. And she said that she wanted Tiana Taylor to play her in her biopic film. And guess what? A couple of years later, we're here and she's doing it. I'm excited for Tiana because you remember she went through this frustration in her music career. She um, she said that people weren't respecting her music. She wasn't getting the love that she thought she deserved. But I'm going to tell you right now from reading from the comments from when she was in the Book of Clarence and also um, A Million and One Miles, people are loving Tiana as an actor, as a budding actor. And they say that she's really good. I think she's found her calling and I'm excited and I can't wait to see this performance. So this and is, she is gorgeous. She and she dropped that. Listen, um, this is TGIF. So you know, all people, I always have some kind of story that's related to um the topics and the people because I was spent like almost thirty years in Hollywood. I worked in a film with Tayana mm, over ten, about ten years ago, right? It was a low budget film. She was actually assaulted on the film by um the director, and you can look that up. Um, and I remember the frustration she felt. Um, I remember watching her run out leave and leave set and it was really traumatic and to see her ignore all that and this is not to slander him it just is what it is it's just what happened it <laughs> just what happened um there was a whole bunch of ugly stuff on twitter i love when people overcome some bs i love when they overcome some bs and things that could have ruined you oh she's difficult it was her fault no 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 i was i was big sis there i had her back um, and actually because of that, I was banned from ever working with that guy ever again because I stuck up, stood up for her. But anyways, that's, it's neither here nor there. I love the triumph story. I love this woman. It's beautiful. I love she's, um, she has unique features and I love it. it she's just has such a memorable look and I could not think of anyone else better than her to play this role. And I think, you know, everyone, once upon a time, every once in a while, a role comes around that's made for an actor to be in position to go win those awards. J-Lo, it was Selena, Halle Berry, it was um, Dorothy Dandridge. And I feel like this is going to be Tayana Taylor's role right here that's going to really sh sh like stun the world. Mm. And Lil Sis, I'm super proud of you. And I cannot wait to support this. So, yes.